My name is Dr. James Kennedy. I have a doctorate degree in biomedical engineering. My passion is to make people's lives better, to alleviate suffering. I work in the product development group, so this means I take ideas for improved dialyzers and I am in charge of converting an abstract idea into a concrete finished device that can be used to make patients' lives better. People's experience during dialysis, I think, is really important. We want to make a design, a concept, a therapy that flows naturally with their normal life. We don't want to intrude on these people's lives, or we want to intrude as little as possible with our designs. Creativity is one of the most important things for development. I think it's often overlooked and I mean kidney failure has been a problem for a long time. The problem hasn't changed. Our creative approaches to solving this problem in better and better ways are what have changed. To me, engineering alone is solving a problem. The art of engineering is finding the right solution to a problem. Instead of taking whatever comes first or whatever meets your basic requirements, it's looking deeper and finding the deeper requirements and creating devices that interface with people. We design every aspect of the dialyzer, from the color scheme of the dialyzer to the label. We design for functionality, for example, to help patients feel well while they're being treated. We design a special connection with the blood and dialysate ports being both horizontal to help resist kinking in the bloodlines. And we design from this high level all the way down to the molecular level of the surface of the inside of our fibers. How does a blood cell react when it sees a Fresenius fiber? One of the things that I think about is these blood cells are our patient. This is a tissue. Blood is a patient tissue. I wasn't into art until I met my wife. My wife is a painter. Now I look at it differently. I look at myself as an engineer not so different from an artist. I think artists have these feelings, these abstract concepts inside them and they have to find an outlet. They work within the constraints of reality. I feel like engineering is much more similar than I thought 10 years ago. We have this complex idea of we want our patients to have a better life and we have to convert this idea and feeling into a finished product. I imagine my own dad being on dialysis, what I would do for him. This motivates me to be open to finding solutions, design solutions anywhere, whether it's seeing how a mushroom grows in the forest that inspires me to have a new fiber architecture. Or it's having a dream at night after I've thought all day about an insoluble problem. I take inspiration from anywhere I can get it. Fresenius Blue has a meaning behind it. It conveys my commitment to helping people. And not only my commitment, it conveys the commitment of an entire organization of 100,000 employees committed to improving the lives of patients. And I think Blue helps capture this unified feeling that we have across the world. And it distills it down into this one unified aspect across Fresenius.